let's start with question number three of chapter one physics class 12th so in this it says check the ratio ke square over g m e n p is dimensional dimensionless look up a table of physical constants and determine the value of its ratio what does the ratio signify so let's put the value of all and check whether this quantity is dimensionless or not value for k is 9 into 10 raised to the power 9 Newton meter square, Coulomb square into E square. E square is charge that is 1.6 into 10 raised to the power minus 19 Coulombs square and value is also square as well. Now putting the value of G here. So G value is 6.67 into 10 raised to the power minus 11 Newton meter square kg inverse kg inverse minus 2 then we have me value me is 9.1 into 10 raised to power minus 31 in kgs and then we have again mp value for mp is 1.67 into 10 raised to power minus 27 again in kg because it is mass so let's solve this further let's cut out the values which we can so it is newton newton then it is meter square meter square then we have coulomb square coulomb square then we have kg kg with kg so as you can see it is dimension dimensionless because we don't have any quantity here now so when we solve this we get the value of 2 not 2 it will be 2 into 27 that will be 54 54 into 10 raised to the power 39 and remember it doesn't have any value and it says we need to tell what does this ratio signify so you can say that electrostatic force is about 10 raised to power 39 time because we get the value as 54 into 10 raised to power 39 so you can say that it establishes that the electric electrostatic force is about 10 raised to power 39 times stronger than the gravitational force so this is what we get from it. So that's all for question number three.